do you think that Disney should give up their, you know, ownership of the Akuna Matata trademark? Honestly speaking, yes, because we are much more enlightened on matters copyright now. I personally have taken courses in copyright at the WIPO, you know, World Intellectual Property Organization. So I know a little bit about copyright now, more than we did way back in 1980 when we first recorded the song. And then when Disney uh, registered the song, used the phrase in the uh, Lion King. So yes, we are upset. Our song popularized the phrase Hakuna Matata because that is the chorus to the song. Hakuna Matata, that's what, that's what we sing on the song. Disney's first registration, as we've come to learn, was in 1994. This is 14 years after we had recorded the song. This song went platinum in the country. And this is like the national, our national tourism anthem in Kenya. All tourists almost get to hear this song, sing this song, and buy a copy of this song. We were a bit surprised, you know, uh, because <laughs> we said, hey, these guys have taken our phrase, but they've changed the tune. You know, that's what we used to tell each other. But we were so not so conversant with the uh, matter's copyright back in the day, you know. So we just, we just initially uh, said, hey, this seems a bit... You know, we feel we felt a bit robbed, but we didn't know what to do. 